lovely whatever day it is you are watching this. I hope you are having a lovely week so far. So I thought I'd vlog today because I have a lot to do. As you may or may not be able to see down here, I have a suitcase and I'm going on holiday with Dan on Friday. We're going to Greece for a week and I have a lot to catch up on so that I feel like I can leave peacefully without having to be on holiday and think, oh my God, I didn't do this or I left that and I haven't done this. So I have a really long list here that I need to complete and it's Tuesday today so I have done some bits yesterday but this is just all the work stuff that I feel like I need to do before I go I'll probably think of something else when I'm out there and think oh my god why did I not do that but yeah we've got lots of little bits on here so I thought I would film today because why not and I'm so excited we're going to Greece for the week and this is actually the first hot holiday and the longest we've gone away for since moving in to this home. So we've done some other holidays in between then, but only for like three or four days. And it was only yesterday, I was like, oh my God, we haven't actually gone away for a week since we've moved here. We're gonna have to have someone over and like look after the plants and stuff. So I've never had to like arrange that because we've never gone away for that long since living here. I've always been living at home. And yeah, as I said, we've got some stuff to do. I've packed all my orders, as you would have seen a few, and I'm gonna go down to the post office. Oh my god, and something else really exciting is I have another wholesale order to pack. Can you believe it? I'm so excited. So I only got my last one, what, a couple of weeks ago? You would have seen the video last week. And I've got another wholesale order to pack, so that is really exciting. I'm going to do that in this video as well and get that sent out. I'm just going to record what I can and see if I can get this edited and out before I go on holiday. That's also on my list to film a YouTube video and edit it. So I don't really know what to do first. I've got little things that I need to do on like Thursday before we go, like changing my dispatch times on Etsy, um, I have a new deal that's coming out on my website, um, I'm going to try and upload this video on a Wednesday, so tomorrow I will probably have a new offer that I am thinking I'm going to do, maybe like if you spend over £35 to get a free tote bag, I'm just going to have that running for when I'm away, but I, I can't do that till Thursday, but I've got other little bits like I need to prep my Instagram, film TikToks, pack my wholesale order and all my orders, make sure they're up to date, need to do a few illustrations for my Instagram. Yeah, lots of fun stuff. I don't know what I'm gonna do next, but I'm gonna work it out and just thought I would record the journey. So let's go. It's really hard to try and lay out all of the pins and key rings, but this is the wholesale order that I am so lucky to have gotten. So I've just counted them all out. I just need to quickly quality check them, but I think these are all okay. So I have five creative block pins, um, five roll with it, 10 sketchbook pins, five creativity pins, 20 of the UR limited edition pins, five stressless key rings and five personal space pins. I believe that's everything. I've just checked their list. I'm just gonna quickly uh, quality check them and then pop them into a box. I'm gonna have to layer them and it's going to America So I'm gonna make sure it's packed nicely and I've got some tissue paper to go in between each layer So I'm going to film that and then I also need to film it on a TikTok as well So I'm gonna try and do hopefully both at the same time
Oh, look at that. I really need to get my hair done. I'm not even blonde anymore. I've just gone back to being like a weird brunette -y blonde colour. I don't even know what this is. Okay, so it's a little bit later now. I forgot what I filmed. I believe I did my wholesale order. I've packed that up and it's all ready to go. I will show you now. It all managed to fit in here, which is amazing. I think there's about 55 products, if I remember correctly. 55? Yeah. So they are all in here and are going to go out tomorrow. So I've done that, I've drawn an illustration. I'm trying to just get some Instagram bits going. So I've drawn a few illustrations, I just hit myself in the eye. I've drawn a few illustrations to go out next week whilst I am away. And I've also just printed out some of the Patreon goodies. For every single tier receives a digital or printable calendar every month. And this month I've designed a little peachy one. So I've just printed it out myself and filled in when I'm away and all the bits I'm doing this month. And I'm gonna pop that up here. So I don't have a blank version, but this is mine that I've just filled in. And you can either use it digitally or print it out yourself. And then what I'm doing is now I've adjusted the Patreon tiers. If you follow me on Instagram or you're already a patron of mine, you would have seen that the tiers have like changed ever so slightly. So my middle tier, which is £4 a month, which is the ice cream tier, I'm now including some business help sheets and sales trackers and templates and all helpful stuff like that. So I've decided to do a monthly sales tracker every month. I'm going to include one of these because I just feel like I need to keep track of how many sales I'm getting every month as well because I don't actually know. It all comes in from different places. So it'd be nice to have a little sales tracker. So I thought I would design one myself for my patrons and then every month I'm going to change the date up here. So I'm gonna fill this out when I get back from my holiday. So that'll be fun to do. And then I also have, which I haven't printed out, this month I'm giving out a small business help sheet. So it's just got on there lots of tips that you can use to help grow your business and bring in sales. Just some stuff that I've learned from the past few years of doing mine. So I'm starting to do all stuff like that on the middle £4 tier and then the pancake tier, which is £8 and the sweet treats tier, which is £12 a month or £16.50 if you're overseas. They will obviously all get that as well. Plus in the pancake tier, you get an exclusive video, which is gonna be more in-depth tutorials and all like studio vlogs, fun stuff like that. And the sweet treats tier, you get sent a box of goodies to you every month of stuff that's already in my shop or stuff that I design exclusively for the box. But I've just printed these two out just so I can test them and start filling them in myself. So I'm gonna pop those up and then I'm going to get the small business help sheet out as well before I go away. So these will all come out on the first. So if I upload this on the Wednesday, which I want to, it should be coming out tomorrow for you guys. Anyway, I'll stop blabbering on about Patreon now. I'm so warm, I feel like this day has gone by so fast. I can't even remember what I've done. I have ticked off a lot of stuff and I've got a film a YouTube video to do, which I'm currently doing right now, but I don't wanna tick that off until I've edited it just so it is more satisfying. I need to change my dispatch times, but I'm not gonna do that until Thursday because obviously that's the day before I go away. And I'm gonna see if I can go to the post office on Thursday as well so that I'm fully caught up with all the orders. So if you do order today or early tomorrow, I'm gonna to try and get my orders out before I go away. So I'm gonna do a little bit more illustration now. I found out that we're going to the moon, which is freaking insane. How is nobody talking about that? We're going back to the moon again. And I really want to draw an illustration of a moon. And in the day that we go up, I want to post that. So I'm going to draw that. And then I actually need to tidy everything. I need to tidy it in here. I need to tidy the flat in general. So I might film a little bit of that for you. No, oh, that's going to be very interesting. So let's get to illustrating.
dark, so apologies for that, but I'm going to do a time lapse of me tidying the office. It doesn't look so bad, but I've just got a lot of boxes, there's stuff on the sofa here which I couldn't get in frame, and just, I need to dust everything, clean everything down, and pick up all this stuff that's on the floor over here. There's stuff behind my cricket that shouldn't be there, my desk, like there's just bits, and where well, I go away, I just want it to look nice. I don't know if anyone else does this, please let me know. But when I go on holiday, I clean the whole place before I go. My parents have always done it. I don't know why, because we're not there. But it's just nice to come back to a tidy home when you get back. You don't need to worry about cleaning anything up. It's just nice to have a clean house to come back to. So that's what I'm going to do. So here comes the time lapse. <laughs> Um, I still need to put the hoover back and put a few boxes away which are now in the hallway. You probably would have seen I just dumped them out there. Tidying is such hard work. But now the office is pretty much all tidy. Obviously need to shut my laptop down, put the wires away here and like get rid of the cleaning stuff. But other than that, it is pretty much tidy. The one thing I absolutely cannot stand and Dan knows this and I hate it just looking at them now is wires. We have so many wires in here. And it just really winds me up seeing them all and I need to get one of those I think you can get like a box thing that all the wires sit in so you can't see them and I don't like to have wires on my desk I am always so I feel like I'm at a really weird angle I like tuck them back behind my desk but Dan will just have them scattered all over the desk and I'm just looking at him working like that's really annoying me so I've just tucked them all back but you can still see them under the desk and it really winds me up I don't know why wires is just the one thing so I need to get a little box to like hide them away. But other than that, yeah, all clean. Sorry, I feel like I'm really shaking this camera, but my arm's aching. I hope I got enough footage for me to actually make a vlog out of this in true eloquent style. This We don't know how this vlog's going to go um, and how much I actually captured. But hopefully it's okay for you. Also, look how cute this is. My little apple, I got him from H&M Home and I love him. I just sit him on my lap when I'm working sometimes. But yeah, I'm going to let you go. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Leave a comment down below if you would like to. I'm going to go and carry on tidying up outside and then start packing some holiday bits. I hope you guys have a lovely week and I will speak to you soon. Bye.